Today we are making gourmet burgers. Let's get started. All right, I've got all of my ingredients set out here for my bread. And then these two are for the ground beef so we can make our patties. I'm gonna start by adding the sugar, the yeast, and warm water. And I'm just gonna give that a little mix. Okay, so I let my mixture sit for about 10 minutes. And now I'm gonna add the next ingredients. I've got the oil here, the salt, and I'm going to add one cup of flour at a time. I'm gonna mix that up. Now that it's started firming up, I'm actually gonna change my attachment to the hook attachment. Okay, now that I've put on my hook attachment, I'm going to only add half more of the flour and I'm gonna leave about half a cup in here because once I mix it up with my dough attachment, I'm gonna see if it needs more flour or if the consistency is okay. So we might not need all two cups of flour. Okay, so I let this knead for about five minutes and I didn't end up putting any more flour in because I'm actually really pleased with the consistency that it has, just like this. Super soft and it doesn't stick to my hands at all. So this is perfect right here. So I ended up using just one and a half cups of the flour and look how perfect that looks. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop a little bit of oil in. I would say about half a teaspoon. And with clean hands, you're just gonna make sure it's coated with oil, ball it up just like that. And you're gonna cover with a damp paper towel. All right, so here is my dough. As you can see, it doubled, almost tripled in size. And all I'm gonna do now is with clean hands, I'm gonna just punch it down a little bit, just like that. And I'm just gonna place it over here on a baking sheet. Cooking spray. Now I'm gonna measure out, I'm gonna just roll it out like this. I'm doing about 80 grams for each little round. So once I have my little round, I'm actually going to smash it down just like that because they're gonna puff up quite a bit. All right, so I've got them all here. The next thing I'm gonna do, and this is totally your preference, is that I'm just gonna take my little serrated butter knife and I'm just gonna cut the top like this in a cross. Okay, now I took some damp paper towels and I just put them on top there and I'm gonna let these rise about 30 minutes or until doubled in size. We are going to get one pound of ground beef, and I'm just gonna add the salt and the pepper to it, just like that. Now this is really your preference, Worcestershire sauce. And just mix that up. If you just like salt and pepper, just salt and pepper. If you don't like pepper, leave it out. I've got my patties here. This is where I'm gonna cook them. My burger patties are done. It's been about 30 minutes. I removed the paper towel, the wet paper towel that I had put on top. And now I'm going to lightly brush these with the egg wash. Okay, look, this is how beautiful the hamburger buns came out. Look at that. I'm gonna just cut it in half with a serrated knife. Put some butter on it to toast up the inside. So I've got my toppings right here. I've got tomato, onion, and pickles. Now this is all your preference. You're gonna make it how you like it. 
And I'm just gonna start by putting some mayo. Okay, now this is totally optional. I put cheddar cheese on mine. Some tomatoes, some onion, pickles. And there it is. This looks amazing. Okay, so we are ready to taste. Amazing. Try these out. 